This video will show you how to take a long screenshot. It can be useful to record WhatsApp, Line, or BBM conversations and also to save a web page as an image file. This time we will use an application called Foview. This application is very handy and has a lot of other functions other than to grab screenshots. You can watch our video review of Foview app in our other video. The link is in this video description. To take a long screenshot, first we open the target application first. For example, we will take a screenshot of WhatsApp conversation. After that, we click and hold the Foview icon. Here's the icon picture. We click and hold. Then, using our other finger, we tap at the long screenshot icon. And we will see a dotted line with a four arrows icon at the center like this. We can choose to take pictures automatically or manually by clicking on the bottom right. We can select auto or manual. This time we will select auto. If we select auto, then the screen will move automatically when we click the screenshot button. We click OK. After that we click the plus sign in the middle. As we can see, when we click the plus sign, the screen will automatically scroll downward. We click again. Keep pressing the plus sign until reach the bottom of the page or until you think is enough. When finished, we can press the check mark at the top left. Let's see the result. As we can see, the messages are in a good order. Between number 16 to 17, we can see stitches between two different images. Also on number 33 to 34. and 47 to 48. One of advantages of this app compared to other apps is we can directly edit the picture after we take a screenshot. For more complete tutorial how to edit image using Foview, you can watch in our other video. The second advantage is that we can take only the part we want. It can be useful for example when you browse some web page and you want to save only the pictures and not the text. The trick is the same. First, we open the website. Then we press and hold the Foview icon. Then we click or slide to the long screenshot icon. We can set the height and width of the captured area. We click the plus sign. After that we scroll the web page to take another image. We click the plus sign again. And so on. Tap on check mark when it's done. Here is the result. As we can see, we successfully capture the image only with no text. And there is one more advantage. We can take the screenshot not in the form of boxes, we can take it in other forms. To do this, we tap on the bottom left. For example, let's select the round shape. The screenshot will be in a round shape. The result is like this. Thanks for watching. Subscribe our channel for more updates.